is Miki Saki of Japan. This is a birdie putt at the third. And look at this monster. It takes them to minus two after just two holes. Well, Sweden going uh, nicely. We're at the green at nine. Hilton Gustafsson trying to line up the uh, putts. And Val Holland out on the course following the match. Val, how's it looking down there? What's the weather like? The weather's perfect, Wayne. Um, it's quite cool, actually, and very pleasant for the players. Um, the, Sweden is just playing such solid golf. It's amazing to see, actually. The uh, Swedish pair, very long hitters. Has it uh, proved to be much of an advantage out in the course so far? Yes, definitely, um, Dwayne, because the course is playing quite long after last night's rain. Um, and Maria actually is just playing unbelievable golf. She's hitting everything at the flag. How about the playing partners, though? I mean, Sweden really taking things to the opposition. Japan, not uh, too bad at the moment, but one drop shot. It's been a good season for Maria Hjors. She uh, picked up a, an event. She won the Navistar LPGA Classic this year on the LPGA. That wasn't a very good putt from Maria, but uh, finished tied for second. Mizuno Classic. Seven top ten she had. I'll also add she finished tied for second in the British Open as well. Both team members play their own ball and just the one score counts. So you expect to see a number of birdies in this format. And you can also have a bit of a go as well. A bit of tactics are involved here. One player can play a little safe if needed. Well, oh, straight in she goes. Safety for Japan. And of course is Mara Miyazato. Japan so far today picked up three birdies, but dropped a shot on the fourth. Short par four, so it's quite unusual that uh, neither player could at least make a par there. Now, Mickey Saki now. Like you. Lips it out, went for it after getting the safety part, going for the birdie. In Japan at nine. Darson, because you won't get two stronger players playing. But this is Japan. This is Mara Miyazato. It's a safe part of this green, just gone for the centre. But she's got a pretty decent putt there. Green has been playing a little hard and playing a high cut into it. Starting it just left of the flag. No. Miki Seki of Japan. Oh, there's a nice shot. Indeed. So both Japanese players with a birdie chance. Now we head over to 10. Uh, Japan have a chance for birdie as Miki Saiki stands out of the ball. Rolls it. Slight right to left and she just pushed it. Didn't even break after the hole. And uh, disappointment for Mickey Saiki, all up now to uh, Muramizato. But Mickey Saiki, Sandra, she's much talked about. Also, a decent line on it. Mickey Saiki of Japan into this 12th hole. Oh, look at that. She's almost bounced that in the hole. 
Well, that should be a certain birdie for Japan. Sitting down in a tie for 14th at minus two at the moment. Finish up this one. We'll head off to the Japanese now. This is Morimiya Zato of Japan. This is the 12th hole. They're at minus two. Oh, well, they're not going to minus three at the moment. Well, not with Mara Miyazato's putt, but maybe with Miki Saki's. Yeah, well done. Good birdie from Miki Saki. And that takes Japan up into a tie for ninth. The women's world. We'll go back to Japan now. Miki Saki. Minus three. This is a birdie putt. Oh, that went around the whole hole. But only what goes on the card counts. Good birdie. Confidence booster as well. She's missed a couple of those. Banged it in the back.